Hey, my name is Steve Rio. I'm the CEO and lead strategist at BrightWeb, and welcome to our space. BrightWeb is a digital shop, and we're really focused on social ventures, nonprofits, and companies serious about their CSR. When you come into the space, the first thing you really see is our bike rack, and that's was sort of intentional because we all bike to work. We like to promote that. We're just avid bike commuters, so that's kind of cool when you first come in the space. The second thing you see when you look through the windows is our view of downtown in a BC place and what's turning into a huge new area in the Olympic Village area. And then you'll just basically come in and see our bar, which we hang out on Fridays and have, you know, we have a lot of mixers here and have people over, so that's kind of a key feature for us. And then our little space where we're all tucked in together with lots of plants and lots of light and usually music playing and our huge whiteboard with ideas sprawled all over it. I love the neighborhood. I, we all live up, well, most of us live up on Main Street. I've lived on Main for 10, 11 years, so I really like this compared to being downtown. It sort of feels a little bit quieter. I really like the space. It's open. It's really bright. There's skylights. I just, I enjoy, I enjoy being this neighborhood and I enjoy being in sort of a rough industrial feeling space. So we share the space with Rob Calder. He has two businesses running out of there. One's Boomper Records. The other is Secret Study. And they do a lot of music services. So Boomper Records is a record label. They deal with bands and help do management and things like that. And then Secret Study connects bands and musicians to more corporate engagement and stuff like that. So they're always listening to new music and organizing events and stuff. So it's really fun. We're always talking about what's going on in the city. I think it's interesting. We're, we're two creative agencies quite different in what we do, but we both have a mutual love of the arts and the music scene in Vancouver and just all the people that are making things happen here.